Right, we're going to show you a quick way how you can get to some old receipts so that you can get your profit and if you want to put it in with your accounts. So log in to vivamk.com and go into your account and make sure you're logged in. And then if you go to orders, this will show all of your previous orders and then scroll down to the one you want. So I'll go for that one there. Just click on there, you can click on there or on view, that will open up the whole order. And as you can see, that doesn't give the details of the uh, profit that you've done, it just gives you the total of the order. But all you need to do is click order again, click order again, and then that will copy the entire order. Now, if you scroll down, that's been added into your cart. And now you can see the subtotal of the order, any shipping that you've done, which is obviously a sales aid. And it shows you, you saved. So basically, where you've saved, that is your profit. So then you can screenshot that, and that can go into your accounts. But obviously, you don't want to click proceed to checkout, because you don't want to order it again. And the way to delete that is just, you'll have to delete every one individually. There's no way of selecting them all. And as you can see, it's quite slow. And But a quicker way you can do it, so I'm just going to show you now, if that is in the cart, so it's all there. But a quicker way to delete it is if you go to My Account, and then go to my wallet and then just make a payment i've just done it and tested it for you if you make a payment of a pound or as much as you want then that will actually go into your oh, now i've done that order i'll do it again i'll make another payment and then i'll just put a pound in there And then to make the payment in the wallet, you've got to agree. And then I'm going to click continue and make that payment. I'll pause the video and then I'll take you back. I'll put my card details in. I'll, put, I'll pause it and then I'll show you the cart is empty. OK, so I'll pause the video now. Right, as you can see, I've just paid a pound in, order received. Now, if we go back into cart, then the cart is currently empty. Return to shop, and then you can make your next order. That's a bit of a workaround. I say soon it'll all be nice and straightforward. You get the invoices with your profit, your sales aids. And if you put in an order in now, remember to take the screenshot before you accept the order, and then you've got all of the details. Okay, hope that helps. Bye now.